Hello everyone, welcome back to another video and in this video I'll talk about persistable entity and non-persistable entity in Mendix. So what is persistable entity? Persistable entity in Mendix is something which data gets stored into Mendix database. If I add any data to the persistable entity that will get created into Mendix database whereas non-persistable entities data doesn't get stored into uh, Mendix database or you can say no object gets created into Mendix database for non-persistable entity. So where does the data of Mendix uh, non-persistable entity gets stored? So the answer is it gets stored into the runtime or the device memory where the Mendix Studio Pro is currently running. So that's the very basic difference between persistable and non-persistable entity. If you can say the color of non-persistable entity is orange whereas uh, the persistable entity is generally in blue color and uh, also persistable entity can have indexing concept because there is database involved data gets stored into database whereas in non-persistable entity there is no concept of indexing because indexing is a concept of database and in non-persistable entity no database no tables are getting created so it doesn't make sense to use uh, indexing right so indexing is not available in non-persistable entity so where do we mostly use non-persistable entity to handle json type of data in mendix uh, studio pro most of the time it's always uh, non-persistable entity and also when we don't want to store data into our internal database or mendix database that point of time we use uh, mendix non-persistable entity so these are the basic difference into it you can find more difference on docs.menix.com. Let me know any questions you have in the comment section below and stay tuned for another video. Do like and subscribe the channel so you can get more such videos in coming days. Thank you very much.